I'm putting on these uh, terminals, uh, ring terminal things, whatever, uh, onto the end of this zero gauge, which is pretty thick wire. Anyway, uh, so what? This is how we do it. Um, I don't know. Maybe if you haven't done it before, so I'm just going to show you. It's pretty simple. You get your wire, get this rubber thing. Um, this is a, it's a bit hard to get on sometimes. Okay, so you got it on and off. Okay, then we get a knife and we just cut off enough of the um, outside of this. We got it off. Now we just twist it. Okay, I always find twisting it makes it just that bit better. Once it's on, um, I get a hammer and I bang it. There's, get the, these bits to bend in. With a smaller one, you could do it with like you know pliers or something, but not when they're this big. Okay. okay. Now that it's on. Okay. Now you solder it. This is what I I would. You don't need too much. I mean, it's more just a just to keep it. I mean, the way it is now will probably hold it. We'll keep it close at least. So what we're going to do is just pretty much to stuff it full. Okay. Okay, that took a bit of persuasion, but we got it. I had to slit it a little, but because uh, yeah, it was really tight. But anyway, you got it on there, and there you go. You have a a ring terminal. Okay. I would say I do three of these now positive ground ground and start doing the big three.